So uh, I'm Jonathan, this is Shiley, and uh, we're here, we live in uh, New Jersey, but uh, we came by to see what was happening here, to kind of get a feel for the message and to also uh, show our support. Um, I think what, what I've been hearing mostly from uh, everyone here is really like being, getting frustrated with uh, the income inequalities in, in America and the fact that there seems to be no way for a lot of, you know, I mean, possibly 99%, but just like, you know, a lot of like average Americans to just, to get ahead, to have any kind of social mobility, you go to college, you graduate with a bunch of uh, debt, and then like, you know, maybe you get a job and you're get barely getting paid enough to get anything. At this point it's hard to even get a mortgage for, for a house, and uh, on the other hand you see, you know, a very small percentage that everything seems to go their way in terms of, you know, whether it's bailouts, whether it's any kind of political decision seems to go uh, their way. What do you, um, what do you hope will be the political outcome of this movement? What are, what are your demands uh -huh. of our government? So I guess I, I don't fully believe that uh, our government can do anything because of the way it's uh, it's set up. You know, I thought I think a lot of people here would agree with me in terms of like I, I felt like when we elected Obama in 2008, that was going to be like a change. That that was going to be a, a real change in the way this con the in the direction of this country, and that we you know that we put in a lot of effort in getting Obama elected, and we haven't seen the change in direction that we were hoping for, and we're now you know it's been three years, and if anything it's been worse it's gotten worse you know our own uh, economic situation financial situation has just gotten worse. Um, I think what, what I would like is for, and I don't know if it's politicians who can do this, or if we have to look at the judicial system to really kind of change the balance within in, the, in our current system. And I think that there has to be a way to give less power to money in the way uh, decisions are made in this country. That like one person with a lot of money should not be able to count so much more than, you know, hundreds of thousands of average people who maybe can't make the same campaign contributions but have lives and live in the district of those uh, politicians. So I don't, I don't know enough to know how those changes can be made, but I think it's like actual like structural changes in, the, in our system.